If you want to be able to buy the most expensive players and open the best packs in FC25, go to u7buy.com to buy your EA FC25 coins. It's cheaper than buying FC points and just as reliable. With their already amazing prices, you can get an extra 6% using promo code INCEPTION at checkout. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we have the doubled, doubled evo version of the Sosoko card. Um... With this card, he looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, he looks pretty good. People wanted this review because, sure, he plays in the EFL Championship, but he's French, right? And French players, there's a lot to go with when it comes to the French players, a lot. So it's really not that hard to link if you've been doing some of the cards that have been out recently or you're working with certain players. It's not super difficult to link him with that nationality. Now, with the league links, like obviously, it's a little bit more difficult. But you can make some things work, right? This card in game is a six foot two controlled lengthy player, four star, four star, right footed player. In game attributes. The whole point of using this card is to be a solid defensive presence in your team, right? So attacking with him is not necessarily going to be the main focal point of us. You know, we're not going to be looking at that specifically. We're looking at him defensively. And we're looking at him passing wise as well because he has a long ball pass. Okay. Long ball pass, one of the biggest meta play styles in this game, and he has the plus version of it. And in the CDM position, guys, I'll tell you this right now, it is very helpful to work with. You know, I even use um Patry's card there because she has long ball pass, and it's very, very helpful. You'll see it in the future custom tactic videos, right? Intercept, block, slide, tackle, press proven, technical, quick step. A lot of good stuff to work with, right? So, again, this is mainly checking out his positioning, defensive awareness, defensive tackles, all that kind of stuff. And also, if we get build-up plays with him too, then that as well. But it's mainly seeing what the defensive stuff is going to be like and what that long ball pass is going to be like in certain key areas. So, yeah, we'll see what he's like in-game. Hopefully, he is a beast. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna start off like that, eh? Brother, if he almost got to that, that would have been nuts. Oh my goodness. Bro, he actually dribbles well considering how big he is. Like, what am I seeing? Oh, and forget about it. The physical engagements, like, look at the dribbling. Like, what? Brother, that length he just takes over, man. That's 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 insane. That's insane. Long ball pass is so meta, dude. It's disgusting, man. <laughs> it's so meta. Look, bottom side here. Beautiful pass. Look, even with the weak foot, dude. Now oh, he's there for the interception. Sure. We'll take that. We'll take that. Yeah, 
yeah, that's crazy that he can dribble like that, being a tall player. It's so helpful. That press proven, I guess, on him. First time. Oh, dude, that pass should have been way better. So open, too. Like, he was right on side and everything. Oh, don't worry about it, bro. He's got the reach. Nice goal. Small little touches. Get the finesse off. War pass. Nice try, nice try. It's all double challenge there. Ah, uh, brother, I shot that before you took the touch like ages ago. Oh, Soko. Oh, look, it actually registered that time. That's nice. Well positioned. Oh, unlucky. Would have been cool if we got that off. Go see Soko. Nice goal. Good stuff there, good stuff. What a pass. Oh. I think this guy has precision on him. <laughs> I gotta remember that. Oh, man. It was a great pass, though. We'll take it. Thank you very much. We scored a goal with him. Let's get it. You can commit those runs, right? So you can do that long ball pass. Really crazy to work with, to be honest. He's so good at passing the ball, too, man. It's like nuts. Nice. Work the extra spaces there. Oh, thanks for trying, Sisoko. Cool. Let's 
Let's go see Soko. There we go. Oh, dude, Sisoko's amazing, man. Look at that. Loose possession of the ball. This guy's track back. Just perfect there. Oh, I should have greened it. Should have greened it, bro. Should have greened it. Oh, yeah. They love to go for that little meta mechanic garbage. And see, Soko compensates for it. An amazing pass, but you know, it takes a while for your players to get it going there, you know. Or a pass by my boy. Was he Soko? Force that lengthy out of him there. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm gonna do this. I don't want to overcommit that just because he's the CDM, and if they want to counterattack against me, I'm cooked. As well, there. Yeah, people don't understand how crazy that is. Pass the ball. There you go. Little sweat zings. Finish it off. Small variables, man. Small variables. Having those sort of things, incredibly helpful to work with. Height, passing capabilities, long ball pass, like... Big thanks to the homie for uh, lending me his account for this. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you very much, dude. I, I, we, it's the least we could do for him with the elite points, eh? Okay, guys. So we're going to have to use another website to do the uh, final verdict because Open has not updated him today. I don't know why. But um, yeah. So, guys, let's see Soko's card. This guy is disgusting. <laughs> you know what's funny is that like a lot of the times in this game, you know when you're looking at a card... And you're like, yeah, I could tell that guy's going to be an absolute monster in the game, right? Like, you're looking at the play styles. You're looking at how, he, how he's, like, generally formatted. So it's like, okay, you know, I go on the card, shadow chemistry style. First of all, he's a lengthy with the shadow, right? So I'm giving him 94, 96 acceleration sprint speed, and he's a lengthy, all right? His defensive stats is in a fantastic area with how defensive this guy is, right? He has great physical presence to work with. His reach for interceptions, for blocks, comes off nicely. Fly tackle's nice. Intercept, really big play style to work with in that holding CDM, holding center mid roll. He can actually dribble, right? Surprisingly, he can dribble because he's physical. Sure, he's a physical dribbler, sure. But in an agile way as a physical dribbler. Does that make sense? Because of the press proven given, the, uh, given to the card. Quick step to work with, helpful in the manual defense, helpful when you're on the ball. Like, it's an insane card. It's genuinely insane. It's so crazy that they do this to these cards, you know? Because it's like, uh, dude, this would have been so helpful for the review account if I just did the double Evo on this guy. 
it would have been so helpful guys listen man if you guys are working with a meta team okay and you want to have meta players in every single position if you can somehow put this put this card in your team right because you have like i don't know tail hernandez veron um i don't know you can even be working with like griezmann Tudom, Tudom is box to box, so you'd have to have a formation that works with the box to box. Or you play him next to you play you play both of them in the CDM position. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Brother, if I was serious in this game, this guy would be my CDM next to Tudom. My review account doesn't have Tudom because uh we did that on the console, which was right, but yeah, those two in the CDM position would be crazy, bro. Imagine having a physical presence in both of the areas, but one of them has long ball pass. I, I work with Patchy right now, and I'm like, oh man, like there's certain, there's certain moments like defensively, I'm like, oh, I wish I had a, a solid defensive physical presence here. This is the guy for it. He's insane. Listen, man, I feel sorry for any of you guys that take this game seriously and you did your foundations on something else because he's a monster. Maybe at some point in the future for the other foundation cards, I'll do a cool evolution for them. But meta-wise, with how crazy long ball is right now, and having all of these play cells and formatted like this, I'm sorry, brother. He's an absolute monster. Like, uh, I hate to break it to you guys if you use it on anything else, but he's a beast. He's an absolute beast. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.